Printing within Photo 10 is simple. To start the process, go up to the menu bar and click on File. Then choose the drop down for Print. You'll then have a window that pops up with your print settings. So the first thing that you can do is choose your printer. So from the drop down, you should see the various printers that you have installed for your computer. You can then choose the copies and how many you'd like to print. You also have your paper size here. I can change the orientation. So here I have a portrait going on right now. And if I want to switch that over to landscape for the orientation, I can click on that option as well. From the drop down, you can choose your resolution and change that if necessary. And then we also have the print area that we can come down and look at. The print area is dealing with the maximum size on the page that your photograph is going to be printed. So if I want to change this, for example, to, let's say, 8 inches wide and 6 inches high, you can see I get this dotted line around my photograph. So I'm setting the maximum size that I want that photograph to take up. What's really nice about this is it keeps the same constraints and aspect ratio to your photo. Therefore, you don't get that warped look if something is stretched out or smushed a little bit. The easiest way to see the maximum size that you can print for your page is to go ahead and click on Maximum. That will then fill up the page with your photograph to that maximum size. We also have a couple different options here. So when I choose Print Entire Image, it's still going to give me a little bit of a border and white space between the edge of the photograph and the edge of the page. If I truly want the maximum size, I can go ahead and click Fill Entire Area, and you can see that bleeds over to the very edges of that paper. When you choose Actual Size, it will go to that 100% ratio, but as you can see, now the photograph is bleeding off the page. For color management, we look at the printer profile. So you can have the printer managed color, or you can use this drop down to select from the profiles that you have already installed on your computer. Once you have the settings that you want, go ahead and click Print, and that photo gets sent over to your printer.